track weather with meteorologist Ryan Matouche. Welcome back, everyone, and good Friday morning. It's the end of the week. You made it. Here's what you can expect. First things first, outside northeast Kansas this morning, pretty quiet start to the day. Temperatures comfortably in the lower 60s across the region. Things are going to start to change, though, especially as we head forward into the next few days. We're going to be watching some rain chances on the way. That's all thanks to our jet stream digging down from the north right here. That's going to be providing just enough lift and moisture to help bring those rain chances, specifically Sunday and into Monday and Tuesday. Now yesterday we saw a great day, some low level cumulus clouds hanging out across the area, bright blue skies, bugs in the area. It felt a lot like fall, especially wrapping up with a nice sunset. This particular time lapse just outside of Emporia. We had a photo sent in. This one was from Lowell. Thank you so much. Just outside of Manhattan. Once again, a gorgeous sunset yesterday. Fall like temperatures were in the area. That's not going to be the case today. It's going to feel quite warm and a little bit more like summer. Actually, temperatures in the lower 60s. Currently a light breeze out of the east about five miles per hour. More temperatures across the region for us. Can't complain too much. Upper 50s in Marysville, 62 for Manhattan, as well as Emporia, 61 once again for Topeka. Now, typically this time of year, our average high is about 72 degrees. We're going to be about 15 degrees above that today with our temperatures eventually topping out in the middle to upper 80s. By this afternoon, models are pretty consistently keeping us right around that middle to upper 80 range. This is 630 for us, so one or two hours after peak heating, you can still expect those middle 80s across the board. Tomorrow morning, some lower 70s in the forecast possible, some upper 60s as well. It's going to be a nice warm start to the day. Then by the afternoon, take a look at this. Models have been very consistent in showing these lower to middle 90s across the region. That's going to be about 20 degrees degrees above average and we're going to be getting within one or two degrees of breaking our record. So it's going to be a hot day tomorrow. Future track for us keeping an eye on mostly sunny skies throughout the afternoon today. Can't rule out a few clouds here and there by early tomorrow morning. We're also watching just an isolated chance for some rain showers moving through, although I'm pretty confident dry air should keep us mostly dry throughout the morning hours. Nonetheless, right around sunrise, maybe a quick raindrop or two moving through some cloud cover here and there. But by the afternoon, Afternoon, late afternoon, early evening, mostly sunny skies. That's going to allow our temperatures to really warm up once again into the lower to middle 90s. Fast forward to Sunday, we're watching our front move through right here. Rain showers are looking more and more likely, especially by late afternoon and heading into the evening. So if you're heading out to Arrowhead to watch the Chiefs, keep that in mind. Rain showers are looking likely by game time. Our forecast moving forward, upper 80s today, lower to middle 90s tomorrow. Again, one or two degrees. We could be seeing that a record Sunday, 7 79 rain chances are looking pretty likely taking us all the way through Tuesday as well. Those rain chances consistent through Wednesday, upper 60s, maybe some lower 70s in there Thursday, 67.